What up, this is why I tell you, man. I just got finished listening to that new Mizo mixtape, Loyalty's Love. And you know, I just wanted to give y'all my thoughts on it, give y'all a little quick review of what I think about it. Just got off the line with my nigga streets, my chopping it up, this planet, how we about to kill the streets. I see the devil. So going through this tape top to bottom, I see you only got about 8 tracks, which is not a lot, but I guess it's enough to feed the people. Now Ma has always been one of my favorites in band game, and this solo project has been coming out real nice. So with this one, I'm pretty much feeling the vibe on the tape. I, you know, it got a real humble type mood to it. It got a little bit of struggle in there, and of course it got some classic band game scamming music to it. One of my favorite songs is Everything Good. I like this record mainly because I feel like I am Mazo when I hear it. Like I can understand where you're coming from when I hear this song. Like, he really put you in his shoes. Like this is the type of song that give a nigga goosebumps when he hear it. Another one of my favorites is M.I.A. featuring Biggs. Now this song kind of got a different vibe to it. Like it kind of got that Atlanta sound to it, but mainly with the beat. I feel like he really stepping outside his comfort zone with this one because it's not the usual typical Detroit sound that we used to hearing. So I can feel that. I can understand that. Now it was probably one song on this whole mixtape that I wasn't really understanding and that was Run It Up featuring Dame Dot and Hard Work Jig. Now this song, it started off okay but you know towards the end it wasn't really, I wasn't really feeling it. And then they left like a whole big two minute chunk of the beat with no vocals over it at the, at the end. And I didn't know if that was a mistake or that was just on purpose you know to leave like an impact or something but it just didn't make sense to me. So that was the only song I really didn't you know mess with too much. Now the other only problem that I had with the mixtape it was just too short it only had about eight songs but it had like a lot of features like he had way too many features for it to be so little amount of songs you know if you're gonna have a lot of features you gotta have a lot of variety of songs for us to choose from you know you got you know the typical artist you know album or mixtape has about 16 songs on it 16 to 17 this only had about eight so I feel like if you're gonna have that little amount of songs you can't really have that many features you can have probably like maybe one or two but mostly it should just be you because you know with so many features it's like we're not really hearing too much of you as much as we are hearing the other artists so that's you know the only other thing i didn't really like about it and also i want to mention my other favorite song which was it's hot that song right there was fire man that shit was dope as hell like big's verse he delivered that shit on point man the beat was on point Mas verse was on point that shit sounded powerful man the beat was just banging man when i was playing that in my car man i'm like this shit fire and also i didn't even expect javar to be on the mixtape you know because he, he locked up right now so i didn't really expect him to be on the mixtape but i guess they were you know pre-recorded those tracks before he actually went in but uh I, I, I was really surprised when i heard his verses i'm like whoa shit javar on this shit so i was listening to it and i'm like this is dope you know what i'm saying so all in all man it's really dope the mixtape is really dope i really fuck with it um shout out to Maz, you know what i'm saying uh, keep you know working man doing your, doing your thing so i'm gonna really get this mistake about four stars four out of five stars so we're we gonna get that about four out of five stars right now all right so that was my review of mazo's uh loyalty is love mixtape make sure y'all comment below what y'all think of the mixtape you know let me know what y'all favorite song and if y'all want to see me do more reviews just comment below man like and subscribe all that good stuff man and just let me know who y'all want to see me do next this got off the line with my nigga streets chopping it up this planet how we about to kill it